uh, tropical wave and invest area and the onset of the rainy season. And these are the three things that are going to be coming together over the upcoming week and really impacting the weather here uh, for southeast areas of Asia. And, you know, we still have basically the easterlies kind of wrapping through like that. We have this area that invest 91W is going to be impacting parts of Vietnam. You can see here. And as we go ahead through Wednesday, Thursday and the Friday, you get that flow coming in out of the monsoon tapping into southeastern into China where there's a trough dipping through. And look at this by Friday, just a big old influx of moisture across uh, northwestern areas of Luzon, which I do believe you're going to see the official onset of the Habagat out here. So yeah, it's these several factors kind of coming together, uh, which by the way, these factors alone have already been bringing flooding. In fact, that monsoonal rains has really been impacting northern areas of China, displacing people. You have the easterlies that invest 91W has actually flooded some areas along the uh, Cagayan de Oro uh, area and the river uh, in northern Mindanao. There's been some heavy rains causing, you know, street flooding, home flooding. And uh, in China, on Hui province, you have that uh, trough that's already bringing heavy showers out in that area so as i mentioned it, it's this combination of everything come together which i do believe by the end of the month i've been saying 29th to the 30th could be early june but the official start of the rainy season i do anticipate um setting up here in the very near future it's just you start to get that mid-level flow kicking in you get the mid-level flow you combine that with the moisture kind of developing with this tropical wave and yeah you know it's predominant southwesterly winds could be setting up and you can even see that here look at this here's our tr our easterlies here's our trough and then you get the west pack high the ridge right in there so watch as that ridge kind of starts to retreat you see it out here and then we get this low developing out of china watch this it's going to kind of hook that monsoon and pull it along and there we go watch the closely with the general wind flow Let's actually let's let's get rid of my telestration layer and let's start that over because you can really see right in here the, the winds are generally going out of the east over the Philippines, right? And then watch this by Tuesday and the Wednesday. Look at the overall wind flow. I want you to watch the wind barbs very closely and see how they switch to the south and now towards the southwest. And that is the onset of the southwest monsoon. See it almost in real time there. How the winds just straight up switch. And things turn on and it starts to pull in from the west. It'd be curious how long that'll last. But I think as long as we get that mid-level flow kicking in, that really is going to be changing up things and really turning on that uh, monsoonal rains here. But look how much heavy precipitation is still in the forecast along the Bay of Bengal. I mean, those are areas out there seeing 500 to 1,000 millimeters total precipitation. Absolutely intense. So, yeah. Whew. At least here on Tuesday, still got your general easterlies. But it is going to start to pick up. Um, look at Palawan, you know, you got some scattered showers out there for you, 33 degrees for your high. And then we scoot back towards the east here. How about Legaspi, 33 degrees there for you. You still got that chance of some rain. And then we go back towards north, starting to see areas like uh, along the west coast, region one there in northwestern Philippines starting to pick up the precip. But I think the heavier, heavier stuff will not be until mid to late week. So keeping you posted as always big shout out to our patreon members who support this channel i can't stress enough um the the, the ability to do these updates on the daily uh, is a direct result of our patreon members who support us and um allow us to, to continue to make these even if there's not a full-on typhoon so yeah as always though like i said stay safe out there if you got any questions please let me know and uh i look forward to seeing some of your feedback. All right. Have a great day. Bye.